Many people hit the stores today to do some Black Friday shopping, but if you didn't get a chance to get out, area businesses are gearing up for Small Business Saturday, hoping you will stop and shop local this season. New at 10 Eyewitness News reporter Naka Nuosu is live on Hope Street in Providence with more. Well, Jennifer, after shoppers flooded stores on this Black Friday, many of the stores here from Hope Street to Main Street are hoping that people think local on Small Business Saturday. For 12 years, Frog and Toad has been part of the Hope Street fabric, selling everything from stationery to souvenirs. But even an established local store looks forward to Small Business Saturday. People really come out for Small Business Saturday. I mean, we see a huge jump in business, and it's just a great thing. And you really get a sense that people want to support their local mom and pop businesses. According to the Small Business Administration, 100 million people nationwide shopped locally on Small Business Saturday last year, including Gail Goodwin Gomez of Providence. Why would we want to support a big store chain? They're going to make it anyway. So very much for the small, <laughs> small business. Owner. On Main Street in East Greenwich, Luniac Glamour is getting ready for its first Small Business Saturday. We have a lot of great specials going on. Um, our designers have done some deals on their merchandise. The shop has all things beauty from bags and jewelry to a hair and nail salon. It's the brainchild of two friends and it opened just three months ago. People that own the businesses are your friends and your family and people that you see on the street. Rhode Island's a very small state so I think keeping right. everything local is um, you know, really ideal. Important. Keeping it local is the theme this November 24th, but these stores hope shopping small is the theme throughout the holiday season. You know, businesses like ours on Hope Street give back a lot. You know, we've raised money to put street furniture out, uh, bike racks, mm -hmm. bus shelters. Um, it's more likely that the mom and pop business is going to be invested mm -hmm. in that community. And this is the third official year of Small Business Saturday. And many of the stores that we spoke to say they plan to have extended hours both tomorrow and throughout the holiday season. Live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm Neka Nwosu, Eyewitness News.